Welcome back. Um, we are talking about semi precious gemstones. If you haven't seen part one and two, I'm gonna link it below so you can go over to take a look. Um, previous videos I've talked about jade and agate. Um, and I'm gonna just talk about some of the other ones. I don't have too much of the other ones, but I still want to share it. So this one, first of all. It's really pretty. It's like this orange and like clear opaque color to it. This is a natural color. These are the colors that it come in. Very pretty. I only have one. I forgot. I've done more. Um, this is the amethyst. Um, I talked about in the first video. Um, these were in the beginning considered to be a precious stone and um now they're considered semi-precious they have this really pretty purple color it's the color of the stone it's like they're like if you look at the inside there's like different colors there's that one. Then this one is Jasper. This one right here, Jasper. Um, it's dyed. Okay, this is dyed Jasper. I didn't really do too much research on this one. But it's really pretty. And then I have rose quartz, which is like the most common, and I feel like it's the cheapest stone because I mean, you can find it anywhere along with agate. It's a really um, inexpensive uh, gemstone. But this is the rose quartz. It has like this pink, light pink, translucent look to it. And right there is natural rose quartz. This is from uh, uh, Joanne. And then this is also rose quartz here. So they're, they look a little bit like the jade. This is rose quartz and this is um, jade. Some of the other ones are soda light. This is what a soda light um, bead looks like. These are the colors of it. This one's faceted. They have like these natural blue and like brown to them. This one actually I got at Hobby Lobby. Yeah, soda light. Right there. These are a little heavier than glass beads, in my opinion. It's got like, it's more dense. And then this is Howlite. This is dyed. Really pretty color. Has like these brown uh, stripes to it, and a lot of what I've seen is that like the chip gemstone beads are really inexpensive, especially in store. This is the chipped uh, rose quartz beads. It's a little lighter than maybe this one, and that one is light as well. And then the last thing I'm going to share is the hematite. So this is another natural star. It has like that gray black.
color to it. Okay, so that is it um, for this series of gemstones. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. If you have any comments, if you'd like to share any knowledge that you have on gemstones, please do so below so we can all um, see, you know, information about gemstones. And I will leave links in the description box to some of the websites I went to. Um, some of the associations of gemstones. That way you can go and take a look. And thank you so much for watching.